Hi everyone, I'm uh, Woody, I'm here from ACS Custom. I'm here with Joe McKeldry, he's just come off his classics tour and we're here at his album launch party tonight at the Sanctum Hotel in Soho. So uh, Joe, how you been? I've been very good, very, very busy, um, hectic. Good. We've got one more date on the tour and it's been it's been absolutely amazing, it's been lots of fun. Brilliant. Um, and what, what, what um, so everyone's here tonight to celebrate your album, what's the album called? The new album is called Classic Christmas. Brilliant. And it's basically all of my favourite Christmas songs and a few that I've kind of learned since exploring the classical repertoire. Um, compiled, we've done it with an orchestra, you get the sleigh bells, everything. It's very festive. And what's your favourite song off the album? Probably driving home for christmas it's a classic yes it and is who classic. sang it um chris Ria. northern yeah you see <laughs> you see it's got to be the best one yeah. um so in terms of in terms of our history with you we've worked together since at x factor since you were on the yes. x factor we did your ears first of all then yeah. so going back to that stage in your career um you obviously shot to stardom you're you, you win the x factor but going back to when you first started using in-ear monitoring what was what did it feel like the first time the you used yeah. it? Um, and what made it what made everything better? How yeah. did it improve well, when, you? When we when I, when we were first on the actual X Factor shows, there was many, many occasions that you would be on that stage and the audience was so loud that you would you couldn't hear the track. You know, you were you were singing blind. Um and you, we we used to see all these artists like, you know, Rihanna would walk in, Lady Gaga like Beyonce, they would all walk in with, and they would have these funny things in their ears, and we would all be like, you know, what were they? What are they? What are they? Because you don't generally know. Yeah, well, nobody, nobody really knows what they are until yeah. you've actually experienced and listened to them yeah. and sang with them in, and um, and it wasn't until obviously the X Factor until you guys came along and we had them, and I remember wearing them for the first time, and I re I was like, oh, this is weird. But what I did find is, you never sing a note out of tune. No. It keeps you so in tune, yeah. and even when you do. It corrects you straight away, instantly. You know, you you can feel the the different. You know, it just it totally keeps you in tune. Yeah, and um, and from from then on, um, I mean, what I mean, you could pitch, you can pitch properly. I mean, did it did it improve? Did it? How far into the competition did you start using them? Anyway? We didn't use them until the tour. So wow. we didn't have so any the whole time during the show. The whole you didn't time, have and them. I mean, you know, the audience were like really loud, and there was a few times I had a track where it would start with just a click. You know, yeah. and you'd be like, yeah. hang on a minute, I can't hear the click. And you would just have to literally ta like try and time yourself to hear it. And, you know, I think it was just that, you know, we weren't fortunate enough to have them on the show. Yeah. Um, it's been a few years since then now. You've had a lot of time to yes. rehearse and record and do all the best things yeah. about being an artist. Um, and we've obviously got you onto the new live series, T1. You've yes. just had it on your tour now. How did you find that in comparison to the other... The, our last product, the classic, but also just in general, like the quality of this product. Well, with the first in years that I had, it was kind of like everything was all compiled into one sound, and it, which was fine, you know, because I didn't know anything different. But what I found with these ears is, when on, especially on this tour, I feel like everything's lined out clearly in a, in like in compartments in my ears, yeah. so I can hear the vocal clearly. Like and it's separate. I can hear the drums. I can hear the piano. I can hear it. I can pick out everything. And I and and that, that and I only tend to normally wear one ear on stage so that I can still get that that vibe. Yeah. Um. And and I, what I, what I tend, tend to find is with the up tempo songs I have one ear in, and with the slower songs I put two in. Yeah. And it's like being in a bubble. It's like being in my own. It's like being in a recording studio, which is great because you get a totally rounded performance, yeah. pitch wise, quality wise, emotion wise. Because I can hear everything so clearly, and it's they've been absolutely amazing. Brilliant. Well, we're so happy to have you as part of our endorsement Pleasure. team. Pleasure. So thank you perfect. for having us. And uh, and thank you for everything. And good luck with everything. And when does the album come out? Album is out now. It's out as we speak. It so came 20th, out this morning. Twenty eighth of November. Yes. For anyone that's listening. And the single Last Christmas is out on the nineteenth of December. Excellent. Well, good luck with everything. Thank and thanks. you. It's been a pleasure. Pleasure. Cheers, mate.